I'm just checking in with the vlog from my car. Because I have a house guest that's taking over. All my space is being taken over. I have no privacy. So. Everyone's been asking me what's wrong with me lately. And I keep wondering, what's wrong with me? Why do I, do I look like something's wrong with me? You know, emotionally. And I try not to show it. But apparently it's showing. Because everyone's asked me. So. I finally broke down. And talked to my pastor. Because of he of all people. He hears everything. Everybody's problems. So he of all people should be able to understand. And I was talking to. Uh, as far as dating goes. You know I was talking to. A guy that's praise and worship leader for his church. Not my church, so my church people don't get it twisted, okay? I'm single. I can talk to people. <laughs> and I thought he was going to be a good match for me because we're both so into music and praise and worship. And I thought that, uh, yeah. So as time goes by, you know, he's smoking and drinking. And smoking is one of my, like, things. I don't, I won't take it. Like, And I thought, well, I'm not perfect, you know. And we're so equally yoked and all that. And and he started trying to uh, he'd make comments that, well, if you're my woman, you have to submit to me. Like, oh, that, like, killed me. No, I don't have to submit to you. You're not my husband. It kind of brought me to tears because you get, like, so hopeful. You fall in love with the idea that maybe you found the one or you found somebody that's a good match for you. And then it kind of just goes to crap. But my pastor told me that uh, I just need to stay strong and wait. I don't know when it's right. And when it's right, he will not be trying to make me do anything that's not right. He's supposed to be directing me in the right path, not taking me away from it. So that's like the big red flag. And I'm glad that he bailed. I was one of the people, like, that was a blessing, you know. It didn't work out. It wasn't supposed to work out. It was just a test, and I'm being attacked on a daily. You would be surprised at what people think is okay to say to women. People in church, you know, like, you think they're gonna be more respectful and they try to act like they're on a down low and I don't know what makes them think that I would be on the down low and it makes me sad because I'm like, what's wrong with me that they think they can talk to me like that? Am I putting off the down low vibe and I'm my lahoochie? What's up? But, um, he said, no, it's just a test. They're attacking you because your blessings are coming, and I think that's true. I think that uh, it's a test to see if I'm going to hold out for the right one, and I am going to, and I'm really glad that I have people in my life that I can talk to that encourage me, and they must know that I'm going to be there for them, too. So, and a little praise and worship guy isn't going to be watching this because he never took enough time to really get to know me anyway, so... Y'all get to hear my drama. That's my life. That's my vlog. I had to make an update. It's been a while and that's been on my heart. Maybe somebody out there is going through the same thing. Watching this thinking, well, she's going through it too. I'm not the only one. and I'm by no means a hooch. I, mm -mm, no. I'm down to earth, I'm goofy, I'm always like the best friend, the homie, whatever. So it really hurts my feelings. That guy's thinking they can treat me that way, but I guess that's just the male... I don't know, it's just a male thing, whatever, but... Um, you know, I try not to be angry, I don't want to be a bitter old woman and my friend... Uh, was saying, no, the anger is telling you that what they're doing is wrong, so that you don't want to be angry, you don't necessarily want the anger to be gone. Because you need it, that's your defense mechanism, so. Anyway, I'm going to get off of this thing, I'm taking, it, I'm taking way too long. I'm in my car. Yeah.
delight. So pretty. <laughs> yeah, talk to you guys later. Leave a comment, you know, if you have encouragement or need encouragement, leave a comment below. You can subscribe. Hit me up with an email. I'll holla back.